This is an exercise that I do with all of my live workshops and when I delivered my TED talk in Vancouver. On that day, this experience was even the catalyst to reconnect loved ones after years of disconnection. It's a super simple exercise that can light up somebody's heart and make their day. They may think you lost the plot, but only in a good way. When a message arrives wrapped in nothing but love, the person on the receiving end will feel it. So here's what I'd like you to do. Number one, I want you to shut your eyes and think about someone you love and adore and you cannot imagine living without them. What is it that makes them so special to you? Focus on how they make you feel. If you're not on the bus or in the lift, say their name out loud right now. Number two, now pull out your phone and send them a text message. And it's a simple message. I love you, I miss you, see you soon, kiss hug, kiss hug. There's no need for emojis or LOLs, just type the words, I love you, I miss you, see you soon, kiss hug, kiss hug. This might feel a little bit awkward, but I need you to trust me. Number three, for a moment, sit with those shared feelings of love, gratitude and goodness for another. Then picture their face receiving that message out of the blue. Number four, now wait for the return message or phone call and see what important conversations might follow. Don't be afraid to go a little bit deeper and share a bit more of yourself with this person. Now, sometimes it can be hard to be vulnerable even with the people that we love, but by doing the I love you, I miss you, see you soon, kiss hug, kiss hug exercise, you're building your emotional muscle. You're making someone you love's day. You're making the world a better place and it costs absolutely nothing. It's really, really brilliant and it fills your heart. Once you've done that, I've got another little mental fitness exercise for you. Number five, write a list of other people that you love and adore and you cannot imagine living without. I call these people your village. Who else could you send a little love message to? Number six, I'd like you to send one message a day until your list is exhausted.